Hello everyone, Surgeon News here, and welcome back to another video. This video is something different that I haven't ever done, and it's a tutorial video. And it's a tutorial for Open Broadcaster Software uh, 0.656, the one of the newest updates. Um, this was requested by Eman or Eman. <laughs> Uh, his channel link will be down in the description below for you guys to subscribe to him. He's a he, he just needs a tutorial, and so uh, this is Open Broadcaster Software. It's a open source free recording software for streaming, and yeah. So uh, this is you could download it at obsproject.com. It's the newest one, um, October second. And it's really good, it's really reliable, it gets the job done, as you could see in my latest videos. And so, I'm no techno technology genie, but I'll try my best to see what I can do here. And I'm actually using it right now to record this. Um, so yeah, so if you're into looking for a recording software, and or a streaming software for stwi Twitch, um, here's the one. But I'll be uh, tutorialing, that's even a word, the recording part because I don't uh, use, I don't stream, so maybe later on, but not now. I'm sorry about that, but let's get into this video. Alright guys, we are back and this, uh, when you click the settings, you'll come up with this, the general, so you select your language and then you set in profile, I put it to my YouTube channel. And then enable cursor and show log. I, I, I don't I don't even know most of this stuff, but just you could, this is the only thing that I know. So that's when you record. Will you show your mouse or no? And then you do your encoding. No, oh, I don't really care. Your encoding. Um, wait, what? Okay. Then you do your encoding. Uh, this is your video encoding. So. You will have your encoder. You you uh, click this. <laughs> I don't even know what this means. <laughs> and then you check this. Use CBR. I have no idea. And just um, uh, just follow everything. And for the max, and then you could check this, and then put your quality balance. And then so if I want one, it will be that. Check it. And if I want ten, which I use, check it. So the max bit rate is uh, this is for your computer. So if you have a really good computer, you could go to thirty thousand. But I will use twenty five thousand because I, it's a pretty good computer. But I think it's best uh, for the bit rate for me. And so then you use your codec. Uh, you don't want this because that, then that will only record your sound. You want everything, ACC, format 48 kilohertz, uh, bitrate 320, that's a good size, and channel stereo, I don't, I don't even care about that. And, sure, but, okay. Uh, then, mode, file output only. Uh, this is where you want your recordings to go. So that's where I want it to go. Now my video. So this is your video adapter. Um, and this is uh, basically your uh, graphics card, I believe. And your base resolution, I put it to custom. And to find your resolution, just open your Windows key and search up resolution. And here you will find it. And mine is, oh, well, this is for my other mon my other monitor. This is for my first monitor. It's 920 by 20 ADP. This is my uh, main monitor. And so that's where you'll find it right here. You're recommended and what it is. And yep, so there you have it. And then your frames per second. Um, you uh, the, now YouTube has I think accepted 60 frames, but I still use 30 because that won't make my game lag. So if you have a good PC, then you could run on 60. And I I still run on 30. It's a good. Um, amount and then for your arrow which is um it's just a windows 7 basic uh look uh you would want to do that 
uh, as you can see, disabling arrow is strongly re recommended if using monitor capture. <laughs> but so you, when you record, it'll make your game better. And yeah, so for your audio, a uh, desktop audio device, just for default, what do you want to do? Uh, then your microphone. I have my microphone. It's the Microsoft Cinema. And uh, this stuff, just I don't know what this means. Uh, force microphone, auxiliary to mono, uh, don't know, this is push to talk, I didn't play around with this because I don't really need all this desktop boost, um, so that's that, now for my hockeys, um, th this is again for the audio, I don't use push to talk, uh, I will do my broadcast, which is start stream, stop stream, uh, so I'm not doing streaming yet, so I don't have any hockeys um, for that. And for my stop record, start recording, I do F5 and F4, so that, that, that's how I... It, it's easier instead of going to OBS and clicking the, uh, um, what you call it, start recording, start streaming. Yep, so, and now let's go to advanced. Now this is a little bit difficult. Um, I don't understand most of this, but just copy what I do for... But it, it may matter from your computer. And yeah, so for general, use multi thread optimizations. Uh, you would want to check this. Um, I don't know why. I, I actually got this from another tutorial. Um, so I may link that down in the description. And then the process priority class above normal. Uh, I think this depends on your computer. Uh, if you put it really high, I think the thing may lag if you have a low, uh, low, uh, the low, um, a not so good computer. So I just put it above normal because that's around like av av above average. Because my computer is not the best, but it's pretty good. And then disable encoding. I just did that. Allow other modifiers. Check that. Okay, now this is where you, okay, you can just read that, I'll just read it. Setting this value higher reduces CPU, uses sac, okay, so basically, um, if you put this ultra fast, you ha must have a very good computer with lots of resources, basically. And so mine is recommended very fast, I, that may be for you too. Uh, wait, let me just read this. Setting this value high reduces CPU usage by sacrificing certain aspects of quality. On the other hand, setting this value lower. So th this may um if you do it slower than your uh then you I believe it's worse or maybe bet no it's worse I believe. So your computer I guess runs slower. I I am. Um, not very good with this but this actually depends on your computer I believe ultra fast is the highest so if you have a just an amazing computer that has like no lag um, then it will then that will be um for that and then for encoding profile I just put it to high and keyframe interval I just put it to zero so Rosado um, use CVR. I don't check that. Custom uh, encoder settings. Don't check that. Encode. So all of these, you could also play around with these because you guys probably are better with technology than I am. So that is basically for the advanced part. Um, let me just read these. Encode in full range. Allow 61 to 120 FPS and entry in video settings. Um, I've never seen what happens when you check that, but, oop, okay, you can't move that, I guess, oh, you can. Look at that in the back. Um, and then, force desktop audio in use video timestamps as a base for audio time. Uh, this is for audio and the network, so I didn't do anything for that. And the quick sync um, encoder, rate control method, uh, I, nothing is touched here, you can't click anything, well that's for me. Um, I guess 
I don't know. I don't understand really rate control method. Just put it to CBR, I guess. And now microphone noise gate. See if I go really high, then it goes up. So it this is just uh, decibels, I believe. And um, yeah, so th this is just for your microphone. And then scene switcher. I don't know what this is. Never plug in not running, so I, d I don't use this. And that's basically it. And so yeah, so if you did most what I did which probably most of you have because this is a base usually a basic 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 computer um, it didn't cost that much well it did kind of <laughs> but if you're losing a laptop maybe some of these may change um, uh, so I hope this helps but I will still I, I'm not ending it here of course um, let me show you a preview on Minecraft which I use and we will see about that and oh I totally forgot about this oh okay okay no I'm not going to Minecraft hold up alright so um, this is where you put your what you want to record so uh, Minecraft okay so I'm doing the open broadcaster software capture right now which is a monitor capture but it will uh, capture anything uh, here so if I well actually it won't see if I go it opens Google Chrome right so that's pretty cool but it won't capture games or or my yeah yeah no no it will capture anything I'm sorry so I'm just getting lost uh, and so what you if you want to record Minecraft or whatever you would just want to right click in this box then press add scene and then name the scene whatever you want I can name it Minecraft 2 and you press OK it's not open right now so then you would want to click this press add and then you would want to go to game capture right here because it's a game um, you could do window capture but I would uh, prefer game capture I'd recommend and name whatever you want I'll just name it game capture press ok and now you must have your uh, whatever you want to record open and that's my minecraft right now let me just make it bigger so then you guys could all see and so that is it works fine um so that is like a basic tutorial for open broadcaster um so yeah so i'm actually using my other monitor here so i might not be running that much frames but yeah so let me close this up now and so you won't have anything now and let's go back here so that's a tutorial and as you uh, saw I opened up minecraft and I got that well it should work I don't know why it wasn't working uh, see it's supposed to be like this I guess that wasn't a window maybe um, but that is basically the video and I hope this helped you for the tutorial on open broadcaster software 0 0.656 um, uh, is this one? Zero point, yep and you can download it from here uh, what's OBS? you can read it's from OBS project if you haven't downloaded it um, so let me just go through the settings again for you to see encoding all this broadcast video audio and hockeys so these two well mainly maybe yours unless you're streaming because OBS is really good for streaming as well but also you could use it for recording and advanced um, 
this also matters from your computer. Uh, yeah, so these settings won't be applied. Just saw that. And yeah. Alright, guys, I'm so sorry. I completely forgot. Um, the person who made my channel art, my banner art, um, he he's E Man himself. Um, and again, his channel will be, uh, uh um, channel um, link will be in the description down below. He can make it for you. He's very good. Um, uh, he's very good with Photoshop and uh, with whatever he uses. And I bet you guys like it because it's by him, not by me. So um, I, um, kudos to him for making that. And yeah, sorry, I totally forgot about that. But um, uh, he could do it for you. Um, but yeah, so again, uh, um, uh, to, to, to check out his channel, it's really uh, good. If you have any questions, uh, just don't uh, feel shy to ask me anything. I'll try my best to answer them. And um, maybe there might be black screens um, or something. Just uh, try to go over the settings again just keep rewatching maybe you did something wrong but you could always ask me in the comments down below if there's any questions i can make another tutorial um with more descriptive and better language technology language i guess and i will uh and yeah so, I'd like to thank you all for watching this video, hope you all enjoyed, and if you do, please leave a like, and maybe, um, if you really want me to do more of these tutorials, then please comment down below if you want me to do this, I'm not very good at technology, but I'll try my best to help you, and yeah, and I, uh, will see you all next time, goodbye!